Well, hello! Today we're going to do um, a little tutorial on using the Show Me app and then embedding that Show Me video into a blogger blog. Uh, so the first thing is, you can see that I have an iPad up and ready to go. Uh, the first thing, we're going to go to the Show Me app. And from here, you should already have an account. If you don't already, um, just go to um, Create a New Account. Uh, you'll need your uh, email address and then a password of your own. And this will be the first interface that you're going to come to. Uh, we're going to click the Create a New Show Me. Now everyone should have a picture of their collage already. So we're going to go through the top pieces. First the eraser. If you're writing something and need to erase it, of course, that would be the place to go. Uh, but the next one over is the Add an Image. So we're going to click that Add an Image button and it's going to ask us to take to choose a photo. Now that photo that whatever you've done needs to be already in your photo roll. Okay? So I'm going to go to Choose Photo and mine happens to be in the camera roll right now. And I'm going to choose my 3D graphic of um, a 3D printed model that I had already created. Now if I want to add um, any writing, I can definitely do that. Um, or I can just add my voice. So there's my picture. At the very top, you're going to see a red dot. Of course, that's the recording button. We're going to click that. And now I can talk and um, annotate what's going on. Again, you don't have to annotate. Um, this is my 3D graphic that I'm going to send to the 3D printer um, at Keystone. Okay. That's my teddy bear. We're going to click stop. Not the best recording, but hey, there we go. We're going to save that show me. And if I want to, I can preview um, what's going on. Again, you don't have to answer. This is okay. We're just going to pause that. So let's say that this is just absolutely perfection. Um, if not, you can see it also says delete. Uh, you can always restart and try that again. But for this case, we're going to just click save. Now, name it. I'm going to name it Teddy Bear. We'll click next. Uh, for your case, it's going to be English class. So we're going to choose that topic of English class. And then at the bottom, we are done adding topics. It does make you add it to at least one topic. All right, so now you can see that it's posting my web or my video to the Show Me website. Now, you're done with your project. Let's add it to Blogger. So the next step, we're going to click on your and video. Now I can talk and I'm going to pause it so it's not talking. At the bottom, there's a box with an arrow. We'll click the box with an arrow and you're going to open in Safari. Once you open in Safari, it's going to ask you a couple things. Okay, the very top you see, number one, if you have it in app, at the bottom, it's going to ask you if you like it. Okay, you don't have to like it. Um, but the important one is the share button. We're going to click share. Notice you can either email it to someone, it'll email a link, or we're going to go to where it says embed. We're going to click that embed button. Notice it gives you two things. Number one, it gives you the link to the website. Of course, you could see that at the very top in the URL browser, but it also gives it to you again there. The second one is the embed code, and that's the one we're going to put on your blogger today. You can definitely put the link to the blog. Um, all you do is copy and paste that. But if you actually want to see a preview on your blogger site, then the embed code is what we want. So we are going to, if you hold down on it, select all, and we're going to click copy. Now remember, I've already opened this in Safari, and I happen to have my blogger logged in. Your blogger interface, of course, looks like this. And I'm going to go to my lessons and technology blog, and I want to add a new post. So I'm going to click the pencil. When you use embed codes, you do have to go into the HTML source. It's not as hard as it sounds. But we're going to start on the compose. Compose simply means anything you put on the typewriter, on the keyboard, is going to um, type on there. So we're just going to do um, this is 
my uh, 3D project. And I'm going to hit enter. Well now we need to add the embed code which we already have saved. We're going to click HTML. BR simply means break and we need to go after that. So I'm going to put my cursor there and then hit the enter button. We can now embed that video right after that. We're going to click paste. It's going to come up in an iframe, meaning it, that's the video re, um, player that it's going to come up in. Hit enter one more time. If you have multiples that you're going to do, you would continue to do this process. Hit enter again, in, um, type as you would like to, and then put the next embed code. So now we need to save it. Okay, and then we're going to publish it. Once you publish it, now it is available to anyone who can see your blog. Now I happen to have Google Plus. I don't want to share that out right now. Um, so we'll click cancel. I'm going to go to view my blog. Not that one. blog and you'll notice it says this is my 3d project and my little video is embedded right there okay well that is how you take a show me video and now I can talk and, and put it on your blogger mm -hmm. and all done on the iPad you of course can go to the show me um, website and do the same thing to put the embed code on the blogger um, but I hope this helps, and if you have any questions, just let me know. Thanks.